In this video we are going to trade the double exponential moving average. That's basically a red line you see on your chart. If you hover the mouse over the line you will see that the double exponential moving average has a value. You can find the indicator if you click on insert indicators trend double exponential moving average. The standard value is 14 candles. It has no shift and it applies to the close price. The double exponential moving average can be called by using the MQL5 function IDEMA. The function only has one buffer. It takes the current symbol, the current period on the chart. The third parameter will hold the period. In our case it's a 14. The shift will be zero because we don't want to move it to the right or to the left. And for the applied price we will use the close price. You see that it is going to generate buy or sell signals on our chart. And basically a buy signal will always occur when the double exponential moving average is below the close prices of our candles. And when it's above our close prices here we will generate a sell signal. Now how can we create an expert advisor that is able to calculate the indicator. To do that please click on the little button here or press F4 in your meter trader. And now you should see the meter editor window and here you want to click on file, new, expert advisor from template, continue. I will call this one simple double exponential average. Click on continue, continue and finish. And now everything above the onTick function can be deleted. And please also delete the two command lines here. OK. Let's create an array in the first step. We will call it price information. And we use MQL rates to create it. After that we are going to sort it from the current candle to the oldest candle. That is done by using array set as series. And now we use copy rates to fill the array with price data for the current symbol and the period that is currently selected on the chart. We will start with the current candle that's candle 0. We only need prices for 3 candles and those candles go into our price information array. Let's create a second array. This one is for the moving average and now we use the IDEMA function of MQL5 to define the properties for the double exponential moving average. The result will be stored in an integer variable called moving average definition. And we use the function IDEMA for the current symbol and the currently selected period on the chart for 14 candles. Let's exchange this one to a zero because we don't want to use any shift value here and the expert advisor should be calculated based on the close prices. Let's also sort this array by using array set a series to sort the price array from the current candle downwards and once again we use copy buffer. For the moving average definition we have created here for buffer 0 because the expert advisor only has one signal line we start from candle 0, that's the current candle. We only need the values for 3 candles. You could use more but calculating 3 candles is much faster. And the values will be stored in my moving average array. To calculate the expert advisor for the last candle, we select candle 1 from my moving average array and store the result in my moving average value. Now that we have done that, we check if my moving average value is above the close price of candle 1 in our price information array. In that case we have a sell signal. So we use the command function to create a chart output for the sell signal. In the other case, if my moving average value is below the close price for candle 1, that would be a buy signal. So let's create a chart output. That's about it. Please don't forget the last bracket. And when you're done you can click on the compile button here. 
Oh, I messed up this character here. Let's try it again. And this time it worked without any errors and no warnings. So now we can click the little button here or press F4 to go back to MetaTrader. And in MetaTrader you want to click on View, Strategy Tester or press Ctrl and R on your keyboard. And here you want to select the file simple double exponential moving average.ex5, mark the visualization mode here and start your test. And here is our expert advisor at work. Now it says buy or sell depending on the current trend. And now you know how to create a simple expert advisor that is able to calculate the double exponential moving average and you have coded it yourself with a few lines of MQL5 code.